Hello friends and welcome back to my channel. Today we will see Bitcoin daily return calculation in Python using PCT change method. So this is the Bitcoin data that I have collected in and stored in CSV form which contains the columns date, close price, open price, high price and low price on a daily basis and also from 3rd May 2020 to 2nd May 2021. Same has been stored in the directory where we are going to work with. Okay, so this is the directory in the Python. And so daily return is one of the best way to analyze the stock data. We'll see that one. And we'll uh, first of all we'll import OS and check whether our working directory is correct or not. Yeah, working directory is current. Correct. It's correct. Now we will list out the files there. So we have the Bitcoin daily return. Oh, this one is this one is the, the data we require. So first of all, we will we will import the modules what we require. We will we will take pandas as pd. Pandas is for working with data frames, and import matplotlib. Dot py plot as plt as plt this is for plotting the diagram sorry import it should be import okay import pandas as pd uh, i made a mistake import matplotlib.pyplot as plot for plotting the diagram first now we'll import the data like bitcoin data bt data okay equal to inside the pandas we'll take the read csv read underscore csv method and we'll give the file name what is the file name this is the file name so bitcoin data dot csv we'll paste this one then we'll give the name as index column as date index column as date and parse dates equal to true so it means it will consider the uh, date column as date time object okay so we have run the uh, now we will print out the dot head the first five data and first five rows and bt data dot tail the last five rows means it starts from 5th May 2020 to 2nd May 2021 so you can see just go through the close price see uh, when starting it was 8900 and on the end day it is 57,677 that much change has happened so it can be reflected in the plot as well now we will calculate the daily return so daily return so in, so into the data BT data okay so we into the Bitcoin into the Bitcoin data, we will create a new column daily underscore return, which is equal to Bitcoin, sorry, Bitcoin BT data. And use the clause price, use the clause price, and we'll use the PCT change method, PCT underscore change method to calculate the daily return. We will print the first five rows. So you can see a daily return column has been added, and its first column will be will not be a number because it, it, it doesn't it does not have a uh, base or, or a uh, reference to calculate the day, daily return but, but from second day you have the uh, daily return now we will plot the daily return chart so we will go to the histogram chart okay, we will use the histogram to know how this is distributed okay, so for that you will use bt, bt dot data daily underscore return dot we will use a hist method to create the histogram and we will give the bins we will fix the bins as 100 you can fix your own values okay 
and okay run it will show the now you will get an idea about how the daily return is distributed using this histogram through the entire one year how the daily return is distributed so this is how you can calculate the daily return of a stock and here i have used the bitcoin daily return analysis okay, so you can use the sum also if you are interested data daily return okay column sum okay sum it will print the sum so you can see 208 so some some of them use the daily return sum also to uh, come to a conclusion okay so this is how you can do the daily return analysis of bitcoin using python i'll be uploading more videos please subscribe my channel thanks for watching bye